Hey guys, so I'm back with another video and this one is basically an Android tutorial. So what I'm going to teach you today is if your phone, your Android phone so is in a boot loop which means that it doesn't go further than the boot logo or well if you just want to update your phone but have been facing issues if you're flashing it via clockwork recovery or with ROM manager then and just want to manually flash uh, a custom ROM so you can basically use a story for this now I'll be using fast boot on my computer to show you which is a command line method which you can easily use with a few tools to basically um, let's just say fix a boot loop or flash recovery flash a system image etc now my phone is currently in a boot loop I put this my phone in a boot loop for a specific reason for this video as you can see that's my current boot logo and I it'll be stuck here for a long while it won't really go further than this so yeah that, um, so now how to fix this now I'm gonna switch over to my computer and um, let me just show you how uh, I just connect it using a USB cable here and before you connect it make sure your phone is in fast boot mode for that just google your phone's name for example I'll write Motorola X-T502 fast boot mode and it will just give you simple 3 to 4 step instructions on how you could put it into fast boot mode just follow those and from then on just connect it via USB and then you're all set so just I'll be back I'm switching over to my computer so guys um, yeah, I just switched over to my computer and my phone is connected via fast boot mode so basically you won't be able to see it in my computers but basically the screen should say fast boot mode and you should see the boot logo over there now after your phone is in, in fast boot mode what you need is a backup either a backup for a previous ROM that you used and you saved backup via clockwork recovery or some other recovery now I have all my backups here so I'm just gonna choose one of them uh, if you don't want to use a backup and want to use a fresh ROM the process is basically the same so uh, let me just choose what I want to I'll just use this backup maybe I'll use this backup now when you go into a backup you see these files what you need to do is select the system image, the recovery image and the boot image just copy them sorry about that copy them and then paste it in this folder which I will be linking in the description this is basically oh sorry about that uh, which is basically the configured fast boot files that you will need now once you've done that just exit out of this and just hold shift on your keyboard and right click on this folder and open a command window here and now we have to use certain commands to flash the three images we just put in the folder so it's fairly simple what you need to do is just follow me and I'll leave the commands in the description as well so just write fast boot flash system system dot img and it will just say sending and just start flashing it now you, you can do this in any specific order but I just usually start with the system because it's the biggest in terms of file size give it a few seconds Yep, so as you can see, it's writing it now. Yep. 
Yep, so when you return back to the fo this, you use the side fast boot, flash, recovery, recovery dot img. And this will be done pretty quickly. Then the last one is fast boot, flash boot, boot dot img. And that's done too. Now all you need to do is just click fast boot, reboot, and your phone should reboot now. So I could quickly switch over to my PC uh, phone now. Yeah, so my phone's just booting up after the reboot command I put on the computer, and let's just hope that this tutorial and this method works. As you can see, I did get a boot logo and I might have just put a Nexus boot logo when I was using the specific ROM which I'm flashing right now. So that's about it. My phone just went past the whole boot logo issue and uh, well, mission successful. So thanks for watching. Um, if you have any issues with this method, just hit me up on Twitter or leave a comment below and I'll help you straight away and do subscribe to me if you want more such videos thanks guys peace out